All right, we're back here to start the second quarter. Jack's still being worked on. Dylan makes his appearance. We've got Dylan, Kendall. Dylan's in for Mitchell, I believe. No, Mitchell's still in there. Dylan's got the ball, or guarding the ball. Schmidt's on him, takes it to the top of the key. Loses it. I'm not so sure that should have been a foul call, but they called it. Fouls on Dylan. That's his first. Team's second only. We welcome Drew Brown on the camera for second quarter. And Rochelle scores again. 18 to 16 in favor of the Norsemen. Cameron Meyer is actually taking a breather. Drives and count the bucket. I believe they're counting the bucket. Referees are discussing it. Count the bucket. I just saw the motion. Yep. Count the bucket. Norrisman take the lead, 20 to 16. Willie will be at the line shooting one. The Hubs have five fouls versus Newark's three fouls. Willie shot up and good. 21-16, everything's matching up. My stats in the scoreboard. Oh, Schmidt had it, but just couldn't get out there long and fast enough. Three point for the Hubs, no good. Schmidt with a long rebound, he drives all the way down. And he gets fouled. I thought I had traveling first, but I like the big, huge steps. Schmitty with a big rebound. And he's going to be shooting two free throws. Six team foul. That means they're in the bonus for the remaining seven minutes and 16 seconds of the first half. Schmitty's first shot is up and good. I believe Schmidt's fourth point of the game. He had a three earlier. Looks like Stevie McGrath looking to check in here. Maybe he'll give Stevie a break. Cameron Meyer looking to check in as well. Misses the second. One of two. Willie's got it. A little trap. Dylan coming up. Kendall out there. 15-footer. No good. Rebound. Schmidt. Willie bringing the ball up quickly. Looking for something. Gets it over to Schmitty. Schmitty looking. Back over to Willie. Willie looking into Evan. Evan wasn't ready. Evan looking posting. Skips it out to Schmitty. Schmitty looking. Back over to Willie. Looks like they're working a triangle. Willie. Fake. Evan. 17-footer. No good. Big rebound by Kendall. Couldn't put it back. Nice rebound by Kendall. Just could not get it back in. We've got subs here. And a foul on Will. That's his second. We got some subs in the game. Cameron's in for Kendall. And Willie takes a seat for Stevie McGrath. 6 39 remaining. Norseman up 22 16. Evan. Control a nice trap. Oh, Stevie had it, and he pushed him. He just got, got ahead of himself. Great play, but you're going to get that foul called on you every time if you don't get the ball. If you got the ball, I don't think the foul is going to be called. So both uh, our backcourt, Willie and Stevie, both have two fouls. Three-point attempt for the Hubs. Count it. 22-19 in favor of the Norsemen. Over the top. Turnover, Schmidt. He had the right idea. Just couldn't make it work. Willie coming in the game. Subbing in for Schmidt. Big Jack in for Dylan. Newark going back with their starting five. 6 17 remaining. 22 19 in favor of the Norsemen. 
Good to see Big Jack out there, especially after the potential injury. They call that on Jack. Jack just asking for some clarification, it looks like. On the arm, he calls it. Big Jack's first. That's team six. Both teams will be in the bonus from this point forward for the remaining of the half. Large inbounds pass to the backcourt. Number two brings it up. Willie guarding him. Jack looks like he's a little uh, tender on his leg. Hopefully uh, he can keep it loose. Three-point attempt. Rimming in and out. Off of Norseman, I believe. I saw it as the Norseman, and they give it to Newark. Tremendous uh, effort for, uh, tremendous opportunity for Norseman to uh, capitalize on this. Several people coming in uh, for the hubs. A wholesale change just right there. 22-19, 5.52 remaining in the half. Norsemen are in the lead. Willie calling out a new play. Big Jack really tender on that leg, but I don't think they want it to, to tighten up. Jack's got it, pulls up for three, and air balls. Stevie with a big save, nothing doing. I think Jack might need to come out of the game. Three-point attempt for the Hubs, rebound Jack. Willie's got it, he wanted to get it up quick. Cameron spotting up, it looks like. They could do a little, I think if they could have done a little uh, screen there, Cameron could have got wide open, but they're, one-on-one, -on -one. Willie's got it. Over to Cameron. Cameron for three. Bam! Cameron Meyer for three. They come right back. Rochelle with three. Evan with a big rebound. Here they come. Willie looking. Jack is really favoring that leg. Over to Cameron. Cameron looking. He fires again. Oh, back iron. Nice shot, though. I like the idea. Here come the hubs. 30's hit one from deep already. 25-19 in favor of the Norseman. 440 remaining. Jack's got him underneath. Nice post move by Rochelle. I'd go after Jack every time right now. He's really favoring that leg. And he gets bumped. And he's got two shots. That, that's just what we talked about the other day when uh, Stevie felt the contact. He didn't put it up last time. Uh, but uh, this time he does. Big Jack's going to have a seat. Kendall's coming in for Big Jack. Uh, Mrs. Navarro is going to be working on his leg. I'm not exactly sure. We'll try to get a report at halftime of what's going on there. Number 23, Stevie McGrath is at the free throw line shooting two. Norsemen are up 25-21. Haven't been able to extend this lead too much throughout the game. Stephen McGrath, they call it one-on-one -on -one, apparently, and he missed the first one. I thought he got fouled on the shot, but they called it on the floor. 21 has the ball. Look to fake skip. 21 for three. No good. Big rebound by Evan Schomer. Here comes Willie. Looking, looking. Skip pass to Cameron. Cameron fires. Bam! Another three by Cameron Meyer. He's on fire. I like, I like the concept there. If you have some daylight, fire away. I know my brother-in-law, Kyle Anderson, that's what he does. He fires away if there's any daylight at all. 15 from the corner. Rebound, Evan Schomer. Here come the Norsemen, up 28-21. 3.45 remaining. Willie's got it over to Cameron. Cameron looking back out to Willie. Willie's over to Stevie. Stevie holding the ball, 3.40 remaining. Coach... Barking out some uh, new orders. Willie's got it. New play. Nice cut by Kendall. Cameron over to the wing. Cameron looking. Skips it over to Stevie. And we've got a timeout. A 30-second timeout by the Norseman. 30-second timeout by the Norseman. Well, we've talked about it before. We're getting ready for halftime here. 3.28 remaining, 28 to 21 in favor of the Norsemen. Uh, Cameron has 11 points thus far, three threes. Uh, Jack Clauso is injured. Uh, our trainer is working on his leg right now. Remember, at halftime, you can head out to the BP 
in Newark and grab some snacks. I know Don Carlson and all his team would be happy to serve you. In fact, my daughter's over there today, and she can make you a Subway sandwich like there's no tomorrow. All right, we're back to the game. Norsemen are ahead of the Hubs, 28-21. 3.28 remaining. Stevie's got the ball. Norsemen have their starters in there, plus Kendall, with Jack uh, out with a potential injury. I think he'll be back in the game. We'll find out at halftime. Willie's got the ball. He's being counted. 3-13, 3-12. Running. Norsemen are being very patient. Kendall with a near five count there. Closely guarded. Willie's got him one-on-one. -on -one. Gets a little screen from Evan. Floater. No good. Tipped out. I believe it's Newark's ball. Nice play by Willie not to grab that. For all you youngsters out there, remember, if you're standing out of bounds, you're out. Gives it right to Stevie. Stevie for a two-pointer. That's easy. That's too easy. Their coach cannot be too happy with that. And they're right back at it. Nice defense by Kendall. Great defense. And then they all lost the ball while it was in the air. Ken Kendall uh, grabs a block on that play. Stevie's got it over to Evan. Evan to Willie. Willie drives one-on-one. -on -one. That's easy. That's what Willie likes to do. It looks like we've got a timeout coming, a 30-second timeout by Rochelle. That's Rochelle's second timeout of the game thus far. They've called one full and one thirty, at least from my stats. Norsemen are up 32-23, nine-point lead. 2.31 remaining in the half. Jack's got his, uh, his warm-up shirt on. So he'll be out for the half. And here we go. The Hubs bring the ball up. Little full-court pressure. Schmidt and Stevie. I think his name is Steve McGrath, but I always call him Stevie. Skip pass by the Hubs. That's a long two. <laughs> 32, 25. 2-10 remaining in the half. Willie's got the ball. Over to Stevie. Stevie looking. Over to Schmitty. Schmitty gets Willie at the post. Willie misses the shot. I like the play, though. Here come the Hubs. Driving hard. Pushing hard. 21 with the shot. Over the 6-5 frame. And they hit the three. Come out with five quick points. 32, 20, eight. In favor of the Norsemen. Stevie's got the ball at the wing. Out to Willie. Willie has it, 135 remaining in the half. Willie's got it, gets a screen from Evan. Willie looking, pulls up from 15. No good. Schmitty hustling. Great hustle play. Nothing doing. Here come the hubs. 32, 28, 120 remaining. Nice defense by Schmidt to coming over. Evan coming out deep. Willie's got in the post, and they call the foul. That's going to be Willie's third. And Willie's probably going to be taking a seat here. Looks like they're going to be bringing Kendall in for Willie. Number 30, he has 10 points so far. First shot is up and good. Kendall's in for Willie. That'll move Stevie to point guard most likely. Could be Schmitty though. Hubs have two people ready to check in as well. Second shot, no good, rebound Kendall. 32, 29, 105 remaining. Willie's got to be smart here. Oh, Willie's out of the game. They got him out with Kendall. That's right. Kendall's got it. Looking. Drives. Turnover. 15's got the ball, and there's two points. Just like that, it's a one point game. Remember, it was a nine point lead with 231 remaining. Dylan looking to check in. 
37 seconds on the clock. Is it over to Kendall? Kendall has the ball, looking, gets it to Evan. Evan for three. Bam! Big shot by Evan Schomer. And then we got some play after the fact. I'm not sure what happened. It looks like they threw Cameron. So Cameron will go to the line shooting one in the possible bonus. Dylan checks in for Kendall. Cameron shooting one in the possible bonus. 35-31 in favor of the Norsemen. Cameron's first shot's up. Misses the front end. That's not normal. 27 seconds remaining. 35-31 in favor of the Norsemen. Here's that four-point lead again. Had it all the way up to nine at one point. Guarded, 15 seconds remaining. Stevie's got him. Counts going on and off by the referee. He can, does not want to pick up his third foul. The Hub fans are not happy about that. Coach is yelling out, and there's a foul by Evan. Not a good foul with 4.1 remaining. Their back was to the basket. That's Evan's first. That'll put the hubs at the line, shooting one in the possible bonus. We got subs coming in. They're bringing Willie in the game for Dylan. Fans are yelling out about score. I'm not sure. I have 35-31. First free throws up and good. Fans are not happy about how the scoreboard's being handled. Both Newark and the Hubs. Second shot's missed. Evan with the rebound, he drives. Gets fouled on a three-point attempt. Not a good play by the Hubs. Evan with a great play to drive in and get that from about 38 feet. So Evan will be shooting three. First one's good. Second shot's up and good. And the third shot. And he makes all three. I've got 38-32. They've got on the board right now 38-35 as you can see from, uh, from our cameraman. We're waiting here. We're waiting to see. All the officials are still out here. Can we show that uh, down there? We got all the officials. Thirty-eight, thirty-five, according to the scoreboard. I have thirty-eight, thirty-two. I am not the official scoreboard. I have realized that. Come to that realization. They started the 10-minute uh, halftime clock. They're recalculating. I wonder what our friends over at WSPY have. If they're, and there we go, 38-32 in favor of the Norsemen. We had it correct. Okay, I'm going to take a break here. We will be back uh, in about seven minutes. The Norsemen are up 38-32.
We've got some foul trouble, and we'll talk about that when we get back.